We're going to the house of a retired police officer who has a terminal form of cancer. Mm -hmm. And we're going to build him a pondless waterfall that he thinks he's hired my company Green Peak for. Uh -huh. He has no idea that this is a charity build for healing waters. So, so uh, we're going to let him know that it's a gift. Beautiful day. Mostly beautiful. Timmy, you want to change the design, huh? Oh, no, fountain in the front yard. Fountain yeah. in the front yard. All right. I mean, Let's if you it. think we can pull it off. What? What's he doing? He wants to say to doing the fountain in the back. He wants to do the fountain in the front. So the guy's going to come home and he's going to have a completely different design? Yeah. But he doesn't know about the fountain. One, two, three, four, five pieces. Bottom waterfall's done. Nice. Keep it simple, stupid. Timmy, come on. What are you doing out there? Uh, I'm shocked the neighbors don't call the police. There's a homeless man out front. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna look so nice. So Pete, we're almost ready to call Joe, huh? Yeah. We don't care. That's amazing. That's got the color changing oh, okay. lights, oh, so you can put your police and giants blue up whenever you want. Oh my God, that's wonderful. Main feature in the back. <gasps> holy, holy, wow. <laughs> that is insane. This might be the best accommodation I have ever had for a build-upon day. Wow. Barnegat Light, New Jersey. Not a bad view. A great way to start the day. Let's go build-upon. So Pete, where are we going, bud? We're in Lenoka Harbor, New Jersey, mm -hmm. and we're going to the house of a retired police officer who has a terminal form of cancer, mm -hmm. and we're gonna build him a pondless waterfall that he thinks he's hired my company Green Peak for. Uh -huh. He has no idea that this is a charity build for healing waters. So, so uh, we're gonna let him know that it's a gift. We're gonna let him know it's a gift when he turns it on. So all day he's gonna see these people working there and he's gonna think that this is the crew he hired. <laughs> a lot of guys. And this is what the certified Aquascape finder <laughs> network all about. Beautiful day. Mostly beautiful. Wow. Okay, we have arrived. The flotilla, the army has arrived. Looks like we're doing the scalloped urns today, Bruno. Indeed. So the party that he's going to would normally be bad because he wouldn't be back until 5.30 and we'll be done before then. But it's in the next town over, so I told him it's bad luck and we just plug the feature and he has to be here before the fucking end because I'll just run right back whenever you guys are done calling. So whatever time we're done, right. he'll run back right. over. Right, close enough. Nice. Okay. And we're doing one for that party too. <laughs> we'll finish early, go over there. <laughs> we got enough guys, that's for sure. You've known this fellow officer for how long? Since 2005. Okay, for so 15 plus years. Frog, they're not here. They're not here. Frog, they're already not oh, back, back. Come on. <laughs> Timmy, you want to change the design, huh? Oh, no, fountain in the front yard. Fountain in the front yard. All right, I mean, Let's if you it. think we can pull it off. What? What is he doing? He wants to say to doing the fountain in the back, he wants to do the fountain in the front. So the guy's going to come home and he's going to have a completely different design? Front yard as well, yeah. But he doesn't know about the fountain. That's Tom Smith's. Oh, donation. so we're going to do a harmless waterfall in the back and a fountain in the front. Now we are, I guess. <laughs> I love it. Oh, we got enough guys, that's for sure. So Tom, you brought up an extra fountain and said maybe yeah, we can get we something had, in? We had one in our boneyard. Okay. So. On the fly, we're designing an additional fountain for this guy because, you know, he's going through a lot. And Tom Smith at Garden State Koi, one of Aquascape's longest distributors, brought a scalloped urn fountain, and we're gonna probably pop that in at the same time that we're building a pondless waterfall in the back. This is what pond guys do. Why not? Yeah. This is my first time walking on the job site. See what's going on. Pete, where are we going with this build here? Okay, this is fun. <laughs> Careful, I, I love the fact that the guy's not home and he's letting us do this. And he does not know that this is a charity build. He just thinks sold it to him, was coming out here with his crew. Oh, so we've already done some excavation. This is great. Oh, fantastic. Right next to the pool. This is great. So a little pondless waterfall for a fellow police officer of yours that you went in 15 years ago, right? Yep. This is nice. We have a lot of good guys here. And for me, this is fun. Stay tuned. <laughs> So, Alan, what are we doing up here? We are going to build a small town urn up front. Actually, I think it's a large. Can we brought that? It's going to be great. It's like an extra, it's like a little extra form, you know? Yeah. When they pull up, it's going to blow them away. And Alan is a retired police officer, and when he heard about this build? Couldn't keep me away, man. Couldn't keep me away. Awesome. 
Another retired police officer, state trooper, Jay from South Carolina, moving the materials back. the aqua blocks down here we've got good morning tim from garden state koi you were out here yesterday digging this and getting this all ready right oh yeah we were, we were battling the rain all day <laughs> but uh we're working in sand so it's not really mud so it was actually yeah, fun okay, okay. Uh, for a great cause you know yeah, absolutely backfilling the aqua blocks right now that's where the pump is going to sit and then the waterfalls is going to start right here so in a few hours we're going to have some water flowing baby by lunchtime right that's the plan okay this is how it gets done just digging my hand nice clay so not only do you make breakfast you also dig dirt that's it man i'm a jack of all trades okay so right in here is where the aqua blocks are going to go and then on top of that will be the fountain perfect location on the corner of the patio backyard water feature going in too this guy sure loves water hot tub pool pondless waterfall and a fountain scape nice to have nice equipment tamping it down and ready to build the waterfall what'd you say timmy five pieces bottom waterfalls done nice time yeah the next drop. what time is it there Greg? keep it simple stupid it's not even i think it's nine o'clock so okay, one hour 11, guys. Let's go. <laughs> i love it <laughs> <laughs> okay aqua blocks are ready to go in here <laughs> So Pete, go ahead and explain to me how this all came about. I joined PropShare as a vegan. When I showed up here to pick up my vegetables for the first time, the homeowner knew that I built ponds or had a company that did this type of work. And he said, hey, you want to take a look well, at this water feature I have in my backyard? I'm looking to have it redone. The company that did it 13 years ago, you know, is no longer doing this type of construction. I was like, why don't you tell me what you think? And the homeowner had no idea that I had started the charity that was specifically for building this type of features for people who have debilitating illnesses. So he has cancer that's not curable. Right. So little did he know that he was the perfect candidate for the free feature donated to him. The very first one. The very first one, exactly. And he really has no idea what this is going to look like, right? He no just, way. he asked him to leave for the day. He's going to come back. He's going to see all these guys here with not just one, but two water features now, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is going to be fun. It's going to be an amazing review. Good. Thank you. All right, here we are. Rocks are going in, and you know when it looks good dry, it's definitely going to look good wet. And that's exactly what this pond, this waterfall is coming together as. Some nice, beautiful moss rock and some driftwood and everything else in there. Okay, coming together. Scallop urn. Basin is in. Pump vault is in. Oh, that's not bad. Let's see what time it is. It is 10 o'clock. Wow, right on time, man. Two hours after we started. Okay. All right, filling it up. Filling it up. Hitting a line. Hitting a line. So this should be interesting. They foamed all through here, and they got this stacked slate, and they want the water to come right out through here, flow down. So we shall see. Spillway up there, flows into an upper pool, foamed in, goes right through the stacked slate. Okay, Joe had to come home early to get dressed for a party, so he's gonna be like, what's going on up front? So we kind of hit it. <laughs> Hello, this must be Joe, right? Hey, hey, Joe, how you doing? We're making a complete mess of your yard. That's right. Okay. We're not even going to look. We're just coming. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Don't test them. I don't hear the water in the backwater feature running. I don't hear that one going. Oh. Timmy, come on. What are you doing out there? Hey. Yeah, they're done. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm shocked the neighbors don't call the police. There's a homeless man out front. <laughs> Are you seeing the local too? Oh, that's perfect. Oh, there's a homeless man. <laughs> now there's a homeless guy being helped out. <laughs> <laughs> Good job on this, Alan. Thank you. That looks nice. I love how the stones are all the way around it. I love that. <laughs> how you celebrate? <laughs> they haven't even plugged it in yet. This looks great, guys. That's going to look good. Look at that. Stumps. Spectacular. Good job, Bruno. Getting the lights going. What do you got? 
Oh, that's gonna look so nice at night. All right, let's see what Timmy and gang did back here today. We'll just cover up the pump vault, clean up, add the mulch, some of the plants. Here we go. Wow, that's some flow. What size pump you got in here? Four to eight thousand. Oh yeah. We're running at six right now. Chocolate milk when you first started off. Checking for low edges, moving the foam. Listen to that sound. Very nice. Love the cutout right in here and the water's still coming over. Beautiful. A birth to new waterfalls, Timmy. Thanks, Greg. I'm glad someone gave you a shirt. What's the story here? Uh, Tom's been doing this since 92. <laughs> I moved to town in 92, so I was 11 at the time. So we've known each other since then and now he gives life to my kids. And oh my gosh, and listen to that sound all day long. What's going on, Tom? How you doing, man? Since 92, huh, Tom? Yep. What's your number one selling flavor? Probably blue, but that doesn't mean it's good. Blue? It's not the best one. What's your favorite? I like 1978 chocolate and banana. Bring it on. Give me that? a small one. Yeah, buddy. Chocolate and banana. Which one would you pick? Ice cream! Ice cream! <laughs> Fat kid wants ice cream. <laughs> What you gonna get? I don't know. I think a mango. Feeling a little fruity today. All right. I got the 1978. <laughs> so, Pete, we're almost ready to call Joe, huh? Yeah. I see some smiles. Wow. That's awesome, guys. You guys did a wonderful job. Oh, going away. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's take a look. We don't care. That's amazing. That's got the color change oh, lights. So you can put your police and giants blue up whenever you want. Oh my God, that's wonderful. Everybody's going to know you as the house now with the fountain. Holy shit. Main feature in the back. Holy, holy, wow. That is insane. Timeless waterfall, low maintenance. Oh my God. Beautiful. Flip it on, flip it off. Holy crap. Oh my God. Look at this! We got one more surprise for you as well. I know you thought you were hiring a for this. The last year I started a charity called Healing Water. Since your cancer returned and you've got a medical battle now ahead of you, you're perfectly fit, so you don't owe me anything. Thank you so much. So, so much. Hey, how about it, guys? Huh? Woo! Woo! That's for you, brother.